Ladies, welcome to Gal Intelligence. Today I'm with Larry and Beardy to tell you the nine signs of emotional attraction. This video is actually inspired by Psych2Go's video about emotional attraction, so I thought I wanted to do my own version of it, with the help of Beardy here, of course. Of course, Kay badly needed my help to know when a man feels emotional attraction for a woman already, and I happily obliged. And since we want you to build more emotional connection with your crush, we'll also be telling you the number one thing you should do if your crush seems to be emotionally unavailable. Let's not wait any longer. Let's get to our items. Number nine, respectful gentlemen. The number one thing that shows clear emotional attraction is respect. In fact, respect is actually more important than love in the long run. Respect is what makes the bond between two individuals unbreakable. When someone has developed an emotional attraction to you, they care about your thoughts, opinions, and general outlook in life. When someone cares about these things, then they give respect to these. Did you know that giving respect is actually one way how to flirt with a guy? Respect is actually a very basic thing. Even if you're not emotionally attracted to someone, you should still know to give them respect, especially if you want to know how to attract men. This one isn't the ultimate sign of emotional attraction, but it can be a hint. So if your crush gives respect to you and your ideas, maybe he's on his way to being attracted to you emotionally. Speaking of attraction, do you want to know how to be more attractive to men? Just go check out this video to find out more. Number eight, my honest opinion. When you voice your opinion, especially those unpopular ones, and your crush respects and cares about your opinion, then it's one of the signs of emotional attraction. You know how to make a guy like you with the opinions you voice. But if you encounter a guy who straight up asks you what you think on a certain topic, then you're in luck. You can say that he's emotionally attracted to you. It's not often we encounter people who care about your opinion, especially if it might be contrary to theirs. So if your crush cares about your opinion and wants to know more about it, congratulations. Number seven, your friends are my friends. When someone makes a point to let you be part of their family and friends, it's one clear sign that he's emotionally attracted to you. They want you to be a part of their family and friends to get to know them because they want you to know more about the people who shaped who they are. It shows that they want you to be close with the people who bettered them because they're giving a spot to you. When you not only know their family and friends, but you also feel like you're already part of the people he calls family, then you're already secured. He likes you, yay. Number six, in sync values. A big part of learning how to get a guy are the values you hold on to. No one wants to be with a person who has different values from them. One sign of emotional attraction is when a guy's values just sync up with yours. When your values sync without any effort, you just can't help it. That will make him love you. Emotional attraction roots from this unbreakable bond that just makes sense, even if you don't put too much effort in. When you have the same values and believe in the same things as your crush, there's no stopping that special connection. Since we're on the topic of special connections, why not check out this video to find out how to make your crush connect with you on a deeper level. Number five, confide in me. When he opens up and confides in you, there's no more obvious sign that he's emotionally attracted to you. We know men aren't known for being very open about their problems and feelings. So if a man sees you as someone that he can open up to, it's a very substantial sign that he's starting to be attracted to you. And not only physically, but emotionally. Usually, we start to open up when we know you're comfortable enough with us that you open up too. So if you want to know how to make a guy like you emotionally and not only physically, then you have to learn to open up about yourself too. Show him that you're comfortable enough with him by confiding in him too. You must be smiling now while ticking these signs off your list. Uh, let's just cut your enjoyment for a while for our little reminder. We just want to say that at the end of this video, we'll tell you what to do if your crush is emotionally unavailable. Stay tuned for that. For the meantime, let's get back to our items. Number four, the only girl in the world. Have you ever been with a guy and felt like you were the only woman in the room because of how he makes you feel? Well, that's a clear sign that there's emotional attraction. If your man treats you like you're the only girl in the world, keep him. You're one lucky gal. It just means that he's interested in you and only you. To him, you're the only woman he needs. Emotional attraction does that to a person. It's like there's no one and nothing else they need, just you. Number three, I'm only me when I'm with you. They say that if you want to get your crush to like you, you have to be the real you. However, when you know that someone is being their true self with you, then that just means they're emotionally attracted to you. Well, we are very different when we're just getting to know people. It's normal because we want other people to think the best of us. However, after some time, you know you want to show who you really are. If you're open and vulnerable about who you really are to your crush, then it means you're emotionally attracted to them. Lucky for you if he's the same with you. If he shows you every flaw, vulnerability, and quirk he has, then it just means he's very comfortable with you. It shows that there's emotional attraction between the two of you. Being vulnerable is one way to get your crush to be attracted to you. Find out more about that with this video. 
Number two, you feel it. This one surprisingly makes the most sense and one that you can be most sure in. Right, Kay? I agree, Beardy. When someone is emotionally attracted to you, you just feel it. There's that deep connection between the two of you. There's no explaining it. It's just there. It just makes sense. If you feel like he just understands you with everything and you're the same with him, then it's right there, that emotional connection and attraction. It's really hard to go further into this one because that's really it. You just feel it. Number one, inconvenient? I don't know that. This sign is the biggest sign ever. You honestly can't miss this. Sure, men have a hero instinct when they love to save the day for you, but what sets apart a normal man from someone who's emotionally attracted to you is inconvenience. When a man goes out of his way and helps you, even if it's so inconvenient for him, you mean a lot to him. It's a big thing to watch out for. It could be anything. When he's willing to cancel plans with people just to help you with something, consider yourself lucky. Always remember that yes, people will help you, but not everyone will help you when it's not convenient for them. As we said earlier, we'll now tell you the one thing you should do when your crush seems emotionally unavailable. Beardy, have you ever heard of the secret law of attraction? Kate, are you saying that they should use the law of attraction when their crush is emotionally unavailable? Mm, something like that. When someone is emotionally unavailable, you shouldn't force them or yourself into a relationship. Remember that it's not up to you to change him or his ways. Although, at the end of the day, it's ultimately your choice if you want to pursue it or not, remember that someone's emotional unavailability could go back to even before they met you. So if your crush is emotionally unavailable, work on yourself first and don't force a relationship. You can manifest things into reality if you really want to go through it. Do you know more obvious signs of emotional attraction? Share it with us in the comments below. We hope you notice these signs of emotional attraction in your crush. Now you know you can flirt your way further into his heart. Check out this video from us to know how to get a guy by flirting with him. These seven tricks will help you attract any man and learn how to impress a guy. Go on, check out the video.